Welcome to this edition of Ask the Expert. My name is Martin and I'm a product expert for laser cutting machines. Our topic for today is how to sort parts efficiently at the laser machine. In the past years, laser cutting machines have become more and more productive. But in most sheet metal productions, the cutting process is just the first of many production steps. Therefore, cut parts need to be transferred quickly to the next production step, such as the bending machine. So parts need to be taken out of the scrap skeleton quickly and with the designation for the next production step. That is what we call sorting. Sorting means to take the parts out of the skeleton and know where they have to go next. The better the sorting process is handled at the laser machine, the higher is the overall productivity and the shorter the delivery times. Sorting parts by hand is still the most flexible way to sort parts, but it requires human effort and sometimes the worker needs some assistance. This assistance can be physical, making the physical work more ergonomic for the worker. The assistance can also be information based, helping the worker to know how to sort the parts. Customers might want to have everything done automatically. For this group of people, there are three basic sorting approaches. The first approach is to integrate a sorting function into the unloading automation. Scrap skeleton and parts are separated and then the parts are stacked on top of each other inside the storage tower. This approach is especially suitable when you produce the same nest several times in a row. The second approach is to add a sorting function to the pallet changer. Flexible gripper configurations can be adjusted for different part sizes. And the vibration function makes the sorting process more stable. This method has the advantage that the pallet changer is still easily accessible, so the customer can switch between manual and automatic sorting. And by the way, the previous two methods can be combined into one system. The third approach is to integrate cutting and sorting into one machine fully. This can be a laser cutting machine with integrated sorting function. One main advantage of that approach is that even difficult parts can be cut and sorted with very high process stability. Difficult parts can be very small parts with a high risk of tilting and collision on a conventional laser cutting machine. And a difficult part can also be a big and complex part that is difficult to separate from the scrap skeleton. Another type of machine that integrate cutting and sorting are punch laser combination machines. They offer various methods of integrating sorting into boxes or onto pellets. And they can add production steps into the cut parts right away. For example, threads, countersinks, or little bending procedures. As we saw, there are various ways to sort parts efficiently. And you might have noticed, they are not only about hardware, but also about clever software. So what is the best way for you to sort it out? Let's find out together. Thank you for watching this episode of Ask the Expert. Take care and see you next time.